showing you a simple recipe. It's a utilitarian recipe that I use for sauces, baking, dressings, and that is tahini butter. So let's get started. You will need a food processor and bulk sesame seeds. I'm starting off with two and a half cups of sesame seeds, pouring them in one cup at a time into a ceramic pan and toasting them until golden brown. And then I'm adding them into the food processor successively. Next, I run the food processor four minutes at a time while scraping down successively. Now that it has the smooth, runny consistency, it's ready to pour into a wide mouth jar with a funnel over it. I'm going to label it accordingly because toasted zucchini seeds have a nutty flavor. Now I'm putting this jar in the fridge. This time I'm making raw tahini butter. I decided to use three cups because I tend to use more of it. Again, you turn on the food processor, wait four minutes, and scrape down the sides intermittently. It's going to take a little bit longer because raw seeds take a few minutes more to turn into butter. As you can see, it's not as runny as the toasted sesame seed version, but it is done. And now it's time to fill into a jar with a funnel over it. This jar is going in the fridge too. To taste the butters, I went ahead and whipped up the raw tahini butter in some lemon juice and water to make a spread for my raisin cinnamon sprouted toast. I put the toasted version on a medjool date and it tastes just like peanut butter. Next week I'm going to be showing you what to do with the tahini. We're going to be making kale chips. If you don't want to miss that recipe, click on that little bell down there so you'll be notified when it comes up. I'm going to be doing four more videos on what to do with the tahini. So like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!